Alright, so we're back here again. As you can see, it's still downloading. Still nothing on the phones yet, but still do not unplug USB. Okay, leave it in. It's almost done here. Alright, almost done. Now, let's take a look at the phone here. Alright, should, should go in download mode. There we go. As you can see, it's going to start. It says firmware is being upgraded. Please wait. In download mode. Let's see if I can get a side by side picture here. Let me come out. Let's zoom out a little bit here. Sorry. Alright, as you can see, the download bar, in keys, and the phone are running simultaneously. Now this is going to go by a little faster, as you can see the percentage bar right there. It's on 20, 21, and it's going. It's still loading on the phone here, as you can see. Sorry. All right, there we go. All right, it's in 42. It's gonna stop there for a little bit. It's gonna start again. All right, there we go. It's 45, 47, 50. Alright, it's on 72 and gone. And pause again a little bit for 75, obviously. And we're moving. Now it should go straight to 100. And then the phone is going to go into um, recovery mode. Actually, wait now. I think it's going to automatically um, restart itself and leave the phone. Don't do anything to it. There we go. Samsung. Let me zoom out here. Oh, yeah, my mistake. It is going to recovery mode. All right, Samsung. Yeah, it's gonna reset itself. There we go. We think possible. As you can see, it says here. Let me zoom in so you guys can see. If you can't see yet. has been upgraded please wait until phone is rebooted completely and is out of screen display all right so let the phone reboot completely and goes into title screen so you can see it's still in a three table possible it's gonna take a while obviously as you guys know unless you do a reboot on your phone brand new install on your phone it takes a while so let phone does it do a thing all right, just vibrated. It's almost there. There we go. Preparing USB storage. Preparing SIM card. Running. Scanning, running, scanning media. No, let it do all this. As you can see, the um, 
battery notification was changed. Uh, text message. Sorry about that. All right, as you can see, battery notification was changed there. I'm sorry, it's too close there. All right, media scanning complete. Media scanning running. USB storage. Alright, everything has been completed. Now we can go into the phone. Alright, I'm sure you guys. Oops. 2.2.2.3.6 gingerbread, as you guys can see there. Alright, some of the different stuff that was changed in the phone is um, obviously the battery notification was changed uh, vibrate mode was off we have flight mode GPS, Bluetooth, the same everything in there uh, media scan is still running, that's fine um, the scroll it's a little better now actually it's much better before it would stop at the last one and then you have to go back the other way. Now you can just continue going. It goes right through. All right. So that's uh, three things that was changed there. Uh, okay. As you can see here, the email for like your regular mail was changed. Uh, Google Books, as I've obviously here. Um, Angry Bird is gone. You don't have anger but anymore. Everything is back to uh, stock. As you can see, my um, apps that I currently have are gone. Oh, and another thing here, it scrolls through here also. As you can see, it scrolls through. All right, so that's good there, and that's there. Um, another thing they were saying is with the widgets, it shows we just name everything. Actually, that's pretty much the same. Not much change in the widgets, so I don't know what they are talking about there. Um, power management, pretty much the same thing. I didn't see any difference with it. Functions the same change. Oh, and another thing it's um, it turns the actual doesn't turn in the call in the call screen, all right, but it will turn. not turning either and it is on it turned before so I'm not sure if they fix something on it for it not to uh, rotate anyway that's about it on the 2.2.3 uh, Android